Tonight, we're celebrating those who have served our country with a special event at EAA Air Venture. NBC26's Kelsey Dickinson takes us to the salute to Veterans Day. A parade of military veterans goes south through Warbird Lane as people line the sidewalk, waving and cheering them on. Yeah, it's just wonderful. Dale Rice served as a nurse in the U.S. Air Force for 30 years. My dad was an Air Force veteran and so grew up hearing Air Force stories and love airplanes and decided that's what I wanted to do. As a female military veteran, Rice was part of a group that paved the way for women to work their way up the chain of command. When I went in, there were a lot fewer females and in the 30 years that I was there I saw a lot of changes. Um, women became pilots, women could be commanders, I was a commander of a squadron and um, and the opportunities opened up to us. Salute to Veterans Day at Air Venture honors vets like Rice who dedicated their time to service. We are all about our veterans because they did so much for our nation and for each one of us. More than 350 warbirds are on display this year, a tribute to all military personnel. One reason we started restoring these World War II vintage aircraft was once again to honor the people, not only that flew them, but the people that built them, the people that maintained them. I mean, they're all an important part of the effort. And that's all what we want to do. And on the 75th anniversary of the U.S. Air Force, Rice says days like this are even more special. I remember the 50th anniversary seems kind of like yesterday. Yeah, it was an honor to serve and, and I loved every minute of it. And various warbirds will take off in tomorrow afternoon's air show as well here at EAA Air Venture. That'll start at 2.30 p.m. In Oshkosh, Kelsey Dickinson, NBC 26.